and it does stay dry throughout the day. A cold front will race through during the late morning and the forecast stays dry with that cold front, but the winds do make that turn to the north and it will be a very gusty north wind. It will be mainly sunny and then overnight cloud cover does increase. Expect a partly clear sky. It does stay dry over overnight. The drought looking pretty good. Uh, most areas are in the clear, but there is that dry condition in the southern big country and the northwest big country is seeing that moderate drought in portions of King and Kent County. The temperatures today will reach the highs during the late morning and then during the afternoon temperatures stay pretty steady in the upper 50s and lower 60s during the afternoon. So it will be around average for this time of year. Today, the winds do get really gusty during the late morning as that cold front moves through. Expect possible wind gusts up to around 35 miles per hour. And then during the afternoon, that north wind will hang around before tapering off this evening and overnight. Expect a very light southeast wind. Today for Abilene, 63 for that high, but during the mid-afternoon, it should be in the upper 50s and low 60s. There will be a mostly sunny sky and that gusty north wind. Overnight, light winds and cold temperatures should be near 37 degrees. Brownwood today, a couple of degrees warmer, and then during the afternoon, those temperatures fall down to the 60s. It will be mostly sunny, and then overnight, 36 and partly clear. should be a light uh, east-northeast wind, and here is that seven-day forecast. Tomorrow, high of 59, so pretty seasonable. The winds cooperate tomorrow, so not too bad out there. Weekend warming up Sunday near 71 degrees, and then cooling down after that. 63 Monday by Wednesday should be in the upper 30s for highs, so not, not yet done with this cold weather.